Psalm 91 verse 13. Thou shalt tread upon the lion and the cobra, the young lion and the serpent. Thou shalt trample on the foot, says the Lord God of hosts. In the name of Jesus Christ, may it be so unto you. As you come across this Bible verse, begin to claim it into your life now. The Lord is speaking to you and telling you, do not be afraid. You shall tread upon the lion and the cobra, the young lion and the serpent. You shall trample under your foot. What the Lord is saying there, it's not saying go about looking for snakes and scorpions to step on. That is not how thou shalt not tempt the Lord thy God, says the Bible. What he's saying there is this, as you go about the walk of life, trusting in the Lord thy God, and the enemy brings situations into your life, he's telling you that he will enable you and empower you to tread upon them, to smash them, to walk all over them, to walk all over those issues of life. That is what the Lord is saying to you here. The enemy is going to bring ailments, it's going to bring afflictions, it's going to bring even threaten your marriage, even divorce whatever it is the Lord is saying that he will empower you and enable you to go through it that is what the Lord is speaking here he's not saying go about looking for for deadly animals to step on no 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 then you are tempting the Lord thy God what he is saying here is this as you continue to rely on the Lord God of hosts that when those demonic attacks come your way he will be right there with you he will stand by you and strengthen you and enable you empower you to trample upon them and destroy every devices of the enemy. So I pray today, may it be so unto you in the name of Jesus Christ. And I claim this into my own life. In the mighty name of Jesus, every satanic devices that the enemy brings to us, we shall trample upon them. We shall tread upon them. We shall destroy them in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. God bless you, sister princess.